Hello everybody, how are you guys today? We're doing our nightly. Okay, so I'm probably not going to do anything zodiac wise. Hi kitten. Tomorrow. Oh. Someone feeling a little unbalanced? Yeah, well I am, you know. Yeah, that's true. Um, I, yeah, but I won't be doing the zodiac stuff just for that reason. I actually got a uh, different job, so I start orientation tomorrow. Yay. So that'll be great. It's going to be like four days, eight hours of me just sitting in a classroom. But I get weekends off, so that's kind of... Well, I get weekends off this month, and then the month rotates. So I don't know what days I'm going to have off next month until later, so... But it's kind of cool. These people look kind of nice. Everyone says I'll like it up there, so... Here's to me doing good for myself. It just makes me feel sad, because, like, I feel like I'm leaving everybody else behind. That's all. Okay. Who are we reading for? Eight of Swords. Someone who is in their head. Maybe that's why they were unbalanced. Alright, my beautiful, beautiful Aquarians, viewers, fellow practitioners, weirdos such as I, Aquarian moons, and everybody else who doesn't like me. Whoever else. You just come on round, y'all. Just come on in. Come on, get it. This is an all signs reading, so if this resonates with you, good deal. If not, do not worry about it. It's just a card game after all. It will not work if you don't believe in it. Just boop your nose and here we go. Right? Right. Anyway, first card this person has, well, they're wanting to come back in from the cold because they got the five of pentacles reverse. They might also be trying to or wanting to get back up on their money game, or they're at least attempting to. Oh, like... It's like two people are more closer when they're separated than they are together. <laughs> That's kind of fucked up. Anyway, um, two of cups reverse. There's definitely like a, uh, love separation here. This person up here might still be asking for something, even after this separation. If it hasn't already happened. Let's see. Thoughts and feelings. Prince of Cups. I can move this down. So. There we go. Well, it doesn't need to be down that much. Yeah, that's good. That's good. I'm just being particular. Anyway, Prince of Cups. Uh, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio type. Someone is feeling like they don't want to give their cup. Right? Thought, uh, and the root of that is the Queen of Swords. Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius. Probably Libra since I count that as their card. Um, she looks pretty, you know... Like, at least she's not crazy. But she is very cutthroat, very decisive, but I feel like I'm full of a lot of sad emotions. We have the Fool or the Sacred Clown reverse. Someone does not want to take a leap of faith. They're blasting to that Prince of Cups right here. We got the Queen of Wands reverse right here. She is pissed. She has friends. She's standing there waiting with their witchy shoes, being like, I want what I want, and I want it now. Where are you with it? You know, for the longest time, I thought this was like a big-ass crown on her head, but it's actually a boulder with the sunflower on top. Like, her crown's right here. It just shows how much I pay attention to shit. I don't know why I thought that for the longest time, but it was like, whatever. <laughs> Alright, last card is... Seven of Swords. Someone wants to... Someone's decided to sneak away with their secrets when it comes to this love situation. Or maybe they're coming to this separation right here to, um, speak on, with that load of, like, bad stuff, right? Kitten. I want to put my leg down, man. But you're in the way. I love you, though. I really do. 
I don't know what that was on my table. Anyway, let's see. King of Cups right here. I think someone's become a little self-aware. Like, I think that's what this is throughout this entire thing, because it seems like, in the end, they're going to the separation, but I think it's, like, possibly to unload. Like, they've made that decision. Like, they don't want to. They'd rather just give to themselves, but their cup is, like, going down to the Queen of Swords, where it's like, I gotta make a uh, logical decision here, and it seems like they choose to go to the Seven of Swords to the separation, um, where someone is really getting impatient and being tired of waiting on this other person like queen of wands like sagittarius aries or leo that uh fiery goodness that just makes you cringe a little bit every time like somebody just goes off slightly over something or acts all mad and shit mm. something to do with leap of faith kitten no i love you but no man go Go, 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 go. You're gonna rub your face into my nose. Kitten. No, dude. Stay in the chair. There you go. I'm sorry. I will love on you greatly when I'm on the bed. Because that's where I'm going. So. Don't be bad. I hate when I make her mad. Anyway. With this jazzy piano music to follow. Oh, I should have lit my candle. Um, well, it's burns. Mmm. Let's see. Yeah, I would feel better lighting that because, you know, you're fine, kids. Mom's just doing her thing. Or I'll just get a tea light. That way it doesn't make a mess. Do I have a lighter? Bazinga! Kitten, I swear to... Okay, whatever, man. I don't care anymore. I'm still lighting this candle, so you're just gonna have to deal with it. No! You better... This is a terrible night. Anyway! Sorry about that. You get off the table. Anyway, this clearing um, definitely is somebody. Like, def like they're just. It's like they're seeing what might be happening. It's like they're the dude over here who's crying while this other person was begging. Right? Something to start something new. It might have been what the begging was about. But somebody had to go inside and start with a clean slate. Become a wanderer, explore, look for answers. <coughs> mm. Oh, that's there. That's great. Anyway, um... It seems like... It's like the person who was begging had to go and start something new. They had to go inside and explore what was going on. But I'm going to use my whatchamacallits to clarify. Actually, maybe I'll use Rider Waite. Yeah, I'll use Rider Waite. That's more appealing to me right now. Not that I don't like the Shadowscape deck, but it's just, you know. Rider Waite was my first deck, so... <coughs> Yeah, get out of my throat. Two of Cups Reverse Separation. Right? There's a King of Cups right here. He's reversed, but he's upright right here. So I, I'm definitely feeling like... I don't know. I like to say in this version, he uses his powers for evil. He's a diviner. He's a sage. It's like he knows better. But he just didn't give a fuck. Like, that's the energy I get from him when he's reversed like that. Like, he knows, and he knows better, but he doesn't give a fuck about your feelings, right? Hmm. But he was in that I don't care kind of mode. Possibly dealing with this Queen of Wands who's very, uh, 
analytical. She can calculate, she can theorize, she's got webs everywhere, and there is no recovery. No restore, no rejuvenation involved. Okay, so, yes, that's fine. I need to throw that away. All right, so what's up with this Five of Pentacles reverse scenario? What did they do when they became the fool? Well, they got out of some bad shit <laughs> with the devil, possibly a Capricorn. Um, found some justice, I think. I think they were in a bad situation somewhere. Maybe? I don't... Well, wait. This, now this just became confusing. All right. There is a five of pentacles situation where, like, the person begging at somebody else who had their head down had to go inside and start looking at everything. It's like they just started actually looking at themselves or looking inside at everything that happened. And it was like they felt justified in breaking off this devil energy thing because this is almost like obsession like the devil card could talk about obsessions too it happens to be capricorn's card and that's just like what the fuck but you know someone has to be that guy i guess <laughs> but it's like it's almost like someone was justified in ending a um devil relationship here but they really didn't know what they were doing because now it's like ah, i can't sleep at night this this is shitty this is a bad time right um, two of Cups reverse scenario. This King of Cups right here now has his guard up because there is no recovery. Or maybe this uh, Queen of Wands has her guard up. One of the two. Maybe they both do. Um, got the guard up in order to recover their heart. In order to offer new love. Hmm. Or in order to receive love. Huh, but nothing was recovered from it, so. Well, maybe someone still needs some time to, like, mend their broken hearts and shit. Alright. Prince of Cups, reverse. Cancer Scorpio, Pisces, once again. He don't want to offer his cup to this scenario, or at least not the Queen of Wands, because that would be the direction... It, that the cup we're looking at well it'd be more like at this um lack of taking a leap of faith which i still think is the same querent right um that might not have been the best idea in fact it was a pretty piss poor idea it wasn't powerful enough it wasn't dynamic enough um someone might have gotten filled with a f with an unyielding rage for no reason like they just hyped themselves up a little bit too much you know, he's just like, I can do this, I can win, raw, raw, you know, like, it, one of those things where they just gas their own selves up, I feel like. Huh. That's thoughts and feelings. Um, and it seems like they kept that shit up, they had the stamina, the potency, to just howl, waiting for the open doors. This has Aries on it, but this could also mean, uh, Gemini as well. That's definitely air signs. So someone definitely thought about that. Was definitely a thought. Um, like you could outlast the other person. Queer it. Is that what you were feel? Is that what you're feeling or what you were feeling at that time? One more. Ah. Uh, Five of Pentacles again. Calamity or complexity and concern. But it's reversed. So someone was wanting to still get out of this. So. Wow, okay. So it was like they decided not to um, offer their feelings up because they wanted to hold out and think that that would get them out of this calamity that came if they tried to express their cup but now they're kind of like played because they don't know what to do now because they didn't offer their cup because they thought they were justified in what they were doing it's like they were withholding their love in order to get a or receive a cup or something but it, but it's like could be a water sign 
Just saying. But it's like this water side. The, the king of cups is reversed right here, but he's upright right here. Like, the dude thought about it, right? Like, he actually took the time to think, oh, maybe I should have possibly been more like Queen of Swords. Or this could be the person they're actually dealing with. And that's why this is all stemming out as well. But it's like, it's kind of like the one yesterday. Um, this person just kind of held out and didn't actually, like, you know... Hmm. You know, like, if they wanted to love, I feel like they should have said something. But it's like every sword, except for the Queen of Swords right here, and, you know, she's not entirely reliable either, because, like, air signs are cutthroat. Um, sometimes they could be ditzy. Just a little, like, airheaded, you know. But that's not a bad thing, because that gives them more of an advantage to understand the flow of shit, too. You know, when you're grounded like an earth sign, like, it's really hard to change um, your thought patterns. It's, it's hard to change, period, honestly. And air signs have the advantage of going with whatever flow there is. A lot like water. But I'm not sure if they cry as much or not. So that's my own little bias right there. But it's just, there, like, there's no communication at all. And if it is, it's all funky. It's like, there's nothing really here that's saying anything to anybody, right? So, yeah. Let's see. Queen of Swords, the root of the thoughts and feelings. Um, someone just wants to come out dazed and confused. <laughs> or they tried to come out of being dazed and confused. Nida, wands right here, but now it's reverse. It's got Leo on it. It's, um, usually be keeping their guard up because, like, they don't understand, but now it's like they're coming out of that understanding with the Nine of Wands reverse. Realizing that things weren't going to cycle or be faded with the Wheel of Fortune reverse. But they get like a happily ever after everything comes together, blends, meld, mix, what have you. Um... I can't tell if it's because they thought that's what they were going to get from all of that. Or if they're going to be like a phoenix and bring this upon them. It's got cancer sign on it. Maybe they were had a hope, a wish, a dream that they thought would come together or something. Let's see. So, thoughts and feelings where they were very confused on how to get out of a bad situation. I feel like they're still in the same situation. And, like, nothing's really changed. Uh, lack of communication. There's an Aquarius right there. So you might be dealing with an Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Uh, Queen of Wands. <clears throat> Reverse, once again. This might just be the same Queen I read for yesterday. Because she was reversed all in the other cards, too. So this might be the same person. With the same angry queen of wands okay we'll go with that if it ain't it's cool uh they wanted to have their happiness okay um Okay, it's like, even though the Queen of... It sounds like since the Queen of Wands isn't communicating, like, she's become happy like a child. Despite the separation, possibly Gemini right here. Or maybe they're just happy about being separated. It's like, I'm free. You know, here's the five of pentacles again. Like, they were left out in the cold themselves. But this person wanted to come back in. So it's like, okay. Alright, Queen of Swords down here. Trying to come out of confusion about what was, um, something that was stopping their happiness. That's what it is. They're coming out of confusion of knowing what made them happy. Or what stopped their actual genuine happiness, right? 
that things did not work out. Possibly a third party at work, a uh, co-worker, maybe a boss, an employee. Now I don't know. I definitely don't know what to do. Now I, then they're just confused about where to go with shit. Right? And that is a complete tower. Oh. Something just hit somebody. Like, this person was just hit with this Queen of Swords. Like, whatever this is, it's like they came to, uh... An understanding? It's like they just figured out not moving forward, like, just fucked her chances up, I think. Okay, well, what exactly are you waiting for, my love? I'm holding something on. Ah, uh, okay. Alright, it's King of Cups, right? Finally coming into realization about all this shit going on. Um, Knight of Coins. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. This person was an anchor in essence. It was like... I don't know, like, this person was stable for them, and then they, like, ran away like a little page, <laughs> and no love was given, and that's, this person was hoping that this person wouldn't run away. Yeah, this is the same exact motherfucker. Ready? Uh, yeah, I'm ready. <gasps> Ooh. I found this on the ground this morning. I'm taking a picture, and I'm showing that to my people so they can see. I can't even see it that well without a oh, that is I hope it came off straight. For sure. Okay. Cool. You guys are gonna <laughs> get to see my husband's like temporary tattoo. Sharing his care. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, like this is definitely the same person, because I feel like I think it just hit I think they just came to this realization that the person who was the most I, I like I, I don't want, I like anchor. That would be like stationary, um, or maybe a reliable person or somebody who was all that was there, and then like they fucking left and there was no cup given. It's like, hmm, damn. Like they did the. It's almost like they just realized they did the exact opposite of what this person was expecting. Let's see. It's like, like, expression, message, you're not getting this rapture ecstasy, right? That felt like a backstab. That felt like a backstab. Let's see. And now someone is just insecure as hell. Ew. King of Swords and the Nine of Pentacles. What is that about? Now, we already got the Queen of Swords right here, and I feel like it's this Queerant, so I guess this is their counterpart, King of Swords. This person's basically saying, hey, look, I'll cut you out, and I'm going to get money at the same time. Does that make you feel good? No, it does not make me feel good at all. Like, he's all whimpering and shit, and it feels like a betrayal to this Queen of Swords person. They, the Quirin doesn't have to be Queen of Swords. Nobody has to be whatever sign I'm calling out. I'm just, you know, doing my dues. This Quirin just feels like shattered. He's mad and shit. But they're coming to a realization of it. So it's like... This is what they're going to come to. Like, this is what's coming up next, if we will. Right? Like, this tower just, like, hit them or some shit. Uh, let's see. Not taking a leap of faith towards possibly an empress. Could be Taurus. That's the only sign on there. Could also be Libra or Aries. Or anybody, really. It doesn't matter. This is an all signs reading, but that's, like, the energy. So, take that into consideration. Well, the air signs are on the board, both together, the counterpart, so that makes sense, too. Uh, this empress was tortured and crucified, 
and nobody really I feel like listened to them or looked at them like they had like you know mentor sage someone who was wise and it was like disregarded the higher fan can also talk about excommunication divorce when reversed like that right in this case I feel like nobody listened to this it's like not taking a leap of faith It's like this it's like the it's like the counterpart to this querying was just ignored or some shit. So now we got the Queen of Wands here, which I like to say sometimes. It's the Empress, which is just uh, is still young, but still pissed off enough to make take some action. You know. Not just chilling, but chilling with friends and bitches and people who will cut you. Right? Uh, she's all nettle and she was impatient, so she really didn't know what to do. Like, I think she was in her thoughts because it was like, there's a lot of imbalance in this. And she didn't get a wish, and like, she, well, she got a, something she wished for. But I feel like it wasn't exactly what she wanted. Which was the King of Wands reversed. What? There's a counterpart to that one. Someone who isn't very disciplined or devoted. Maybe they realize that, like, this King of Wands right here wasn't going to, um, be anywhere close to what she needed to be, and that's why she has friends and is reversed and just pouting right in front of you, acting like she's impatient and shit, right? Like, I think that they wanted this person, but it was like, you know... Dreams are nice and all, but nightmares are dreams too. They just got a lot more surround sound than our horror movies, that's all. So, you kind of got to think about it that way. It's like, um... I feel like it's almost like they didn't want to fulfill the wish of this dude just because he was being a dick. But it's almost like she also got tired of the waiting too. All right, Seven of Swords. What's up with this, right? Why are they dragging their shit behind them? It's almost like a guilty conscience. King of Coins. Dedicated. Adamant. A very confused looking kitty. He looks like he just woke up from a nap or someone made a squeaky noise. He's not sure, but he's there regardless. Hmm. Did he say some really harsh shit? Page of Wands. Secrets. Enigma. It's like they... It's like they said something harsh or mean. But it was a revelation of something. There was... I feel like... I almost feel like really uncalled for... <laughs> It was like a, it was like a low blow or some shit. Like someone said some really mean, real shit about somebody. Like told them about themselves, but it was like in a really like nasty way. Could have been an earth sign for sure. Uh, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgos, energy right there. Ah, the devil, magnetism, lore, Capricorn's card once again. Ooh, someone talks shit about their relationship. Oh. Oh. So it's like this person right here, right? This king of coin right here came out and said some harsh truths to somebody about the relationship that went you know south or whatever right okay it's like they're being led to the devil i like that symbol i want to put that somewhere but yeah that's like dude shit <laughs> like someone really told somebody about themselves it's like someone told somebody that they were actually the devil you know Ooh. Okay, first branch for this, uh... 
the full reverse up here, right? What comes after that? Because I can't see. Queen of Wands reverse. Okay. Um, someone played their games too hard and won for sure. They drove away basically their home or their business or whatever, and now they're all in their head about it. All because they didn't take a leap of faith. Like, damn, man. That's a crying fucking shame. Like, I mean, I, I, I kind of understand why. But, you know, if, if it comes down to head games, and you feel like you can't or you won't, like, express how you really feel about somebody, like, I don't know, man. Like, you can't, like, be surprised you lost them for good, you know? Like, a human being is relentless, yeah, but we can only take so much at a time. You know, even we need a break. Like, we'll chase a gazelle forever, sure. <laughs> but at some time, we're gonna need a break, too. Alright. Queen of Wands reverse. What's up with her? Yeah, nothing can start with her. She's just like, nope. Or somebody's like, nope. Um, someone... Is gonna keep an eye out. Well, on the DL. Okay. What? All right. So. It's like something didn't start up, so someone's gonna be saying some shit while somebody's asleep, or crawling in their house while they're sleeping, or trying to rest, or some shit, or just start something with somebody, like smear campaigns and shit, right? Just be saying some nasty shit, snooping for no fucking reason, following people, stalking people, um, uh, social gangbangs, um, just getting on shit just to find something out while someone's taking a break. Very strange. Or, Maybe somebody isn't going to start doing this shit because they need to rest. That could be a situation, too. It doesn't mean that they won't eventually do it. But I don't think they're doing it now because this wand is reversed, right? Like, it, like this queen has a bunch of aces that are just different. Also. All right. What was this down here again? I never remember. Seven of Swords. Right. What's up with it? Merriment, gonna be happy, party all the time, right? Oh shit, my bad. I don't think it's gonna be a good kind of partying though. Very interesting. Someone's gonna hold their strength up, battle their shadow side, I feel like. Maybe the square is trying to do that. In order to be an, a nice person, offering over here after this tower. Okay, I'm dropping one more because I'm just, you know. Because it's like they're a page. And it's like the king's been all over this motherfucker. And they're going to come up as a page. After all this, I'm just dis I'm disappointed at this climax. I want to know more. Uh, oh, they're going to put up a fight. Ooh, that one. Okay. And... The Whoever they're trying to put up a fight with is they, they're not gonna they're not gonna win or they're trying to come in and be an enemy in the house, but no. Like there's no victory. It goes down from the seven to the six, and it's reversed at that. The audacity. <laughs> this queer is interesting. Like I'm kinda happy they came back because I'm you know I like uh to be continues, you know, like they're they're very interesting. This person interests me a lot because it's like like, how did, how did you get here? Like, I'm so curious about what they're going to do next. I kind of am, but it's like, I, I almost don't want to know either. Because there are other people who need to be picked up in my cards, too. Uh, so hopefully this is the last we see of this queer it for a while, anyway. At the same time, it seems like that's a, a major problem for them right now. It's like, and I think they're trying to come up to this bitch since it flicked so hard. Like, trying to knock her out of place, and then it's just like, no, it didn't work. Uh, you know, I'll pull out, like, six more cards and just be like, you know, what's up next for them so we can stop, you know, 
picking this person up at least for another month or so. That way other people can come through. <laughs> Is this person blocked? I feel like this person got blocked or something, like on social media or in real life. One of the two. <laughs> They're waiting for something. I guess some offers still. Maybe that's what the strength in the Page of Pentacle is. Like, maybe they're holding out so, like, they still get that offer. Um, then they want to come up and fight this bitch over here. And then they end up... No, it doesn't happen. It doesn't seem like it. Um, yeah, they're looking for the bitch. They want that Queen of Wands right here. Like, she's gonna do anything. She's making horrible music to annoy people right now. Like, well, maybe she's got options. She's got choices. She's got two pentacles. I don't know if I would give one of my pentacles up just for somebody who, uh, I guess wants it after so long. You know, because I feel like these, this, these two haven't talked for a while. It's like they lost. It feels like they lost. Um, seven of wands again. And the world is over. It's like she made a choice. And the dude's looking at this pentacle, which is aimed over here, rather than over here. Like this Queen of Wands didn't give her pentacle away. She kept it. And then this parent completely felt defeated and like their world was over? Maybe that's what the betrayal and how they're feeling insecure about that all is. But in the end, like this King of Swords counterpart is just like this Nine of Pentacles bitch. Just being like, look, I'm good. Look at me. Look at That's the harsh truth. That's the truth at all. I could cut you, but I'm playing with my bird, and that's a little bit more important. Look, I mean, like, everyone thinks I'm a king. No, I'm just a woman in, with really masculine j jowls. That's all. And I can carry a sword better than any hoe in this county. Come at me. You don't wanteth these hands on thee. Bitcheth. You know, like, just sitting there, just letting that person know that, like, they know how to come at you, and they know how to chill. But it's like, it, but it's almost like with these insecurities over here that I think is what actually betrayed this person. I don't think they could tell the difference. Like, I don't think they knew when they were King of Swords and when this person just decided to go back to her regular clothes and become the Nine of Pentacles. It's like they couldn't tell when this person was one or the other. And the King of Swords, like, he won't, he won't, I don't, I, I feel like he'll step up if he has to. Like, if you come up to him. But he really doesn't bother anybody, I don't think. Like, he's a strategic, yes, but he's not really somebody who just goes out and... St like, that's what, like, the cups and the wands are for. Like, he sits there and thinks about what he's going to do before he actually does it. And his tongue is sharp. So, at least he isn't reverse. But it's like... I don't know, but... Mm, I'm sorry, Quirant. Like, I hope you get to move on to something that'll, like... You know, help you through the day. But, everybody, that's the end of the reading. So, I don't know. I kind of feel for this querent, though. I really do, because, like, I think they really care. But it's like... You kind of have to show you care, too, even if you don't know how. You know, if you're authentic, like, people will know. Like, it, pe like, people will pick that up. You just gotta be authentic. That's the advice I guess I have for you. You can take it or leave it, because, you know, I'm, I'm talking out of my ass, and, like, I'm a, I'm a jerk anyway. So, you know, that's all up to you. But I will see you all later, and I love you. Bye-bye.